Rapunzel's name Rapunzel was born. Rapunzel had a very special girl who her magical hair had the power to heal the sick and injured and, and could keep people from growing old. Mother Gothel, a vengeful old woman who wants to remain forever young to stole the princess and lock her away in the tower to keep Rapunzel from leaving. The one told her outside was full of danger and horrible selfish people. Okay, next page. Rapunzel have lots of ways to pass the time when they think to drive, doing the same things over and over. He she thinks to herself, oh, come on, it's not that bad. But each year on her birthday, where she saw thousands of floating lights fill the sky, she longed to know what things are like out, out there. Then one day, when Mother Gothel was away on a trip, Mother Rapunzel have the chance to find out. Okay. Slim Rider, a young thief on the run from the palace guard, climb in from Rapunzel's window. Hello, at last, Lantern said to himself. Fine. Rapunzel now came out from the flying crown. He hit things bad and stolen good. When he woke up, struck a deal with him. Take me to see the floating light, Flynn interrupted. You mean the lantern thing that they do for the missing princess? Rapunzel nodded. And after you bring me home safely, I'll return your satchel. Flynn want his things back. Fine, I'll take you. Very good. Thank you, Daddy. You are coming. Outside the tower, the world was full of wonders. It was like nothing like Mother Gothel had described. Really? Yeah. Okay, hold on. I gotta turn the page. This is so fun, Rapunzel said, shouted. Then she paused. Mother will be so furious. Flam reassured her. A really really a new little adventure that's good. Healthy even. You think Rapunzel said. I know, said Flynn. Okay. But having the thief level guy has troubles too. A lot of people, including Mother Garfield, for searching for Flynn. To escape, Flynn and Rapunzel ran to a car dark tower and swam to an underwater tunnel. Rapunzel's magical hair glowed, lighting their way. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, hold on. Okay, keep going. Mother Gothel failed to stop them. Um, and Rapunzel and Flynn arrived at the kingdom. Oh, it was beyond anything. Rapunzel had a mansion. She and Flynn had the best day ever. Okay, next page. That night, they watched the lantern slip from the missing princess soared to the sky. I don't know what it is, but I feel I belong here, Rapunzel said. But Mother Gothel found them and tricked Rapunzel, only thinking that Flynn helped her is give back his satchel. Mother Gothel brought Rapunzel back to the tower. Okay, wait for me. The next day, Rapunzel started thinking what she thinks and in the way the lantern always released on her birthday, uh, this Rapunzel gasped, I'm the lost 
must practice. She confronted Mother Gothel, confessed kidnapping with Hunter when she was a baby. What is that again? I forgot. Rapunzel, Rapunzel left. Hey, you can't read it. Rapunzel left. You can't look. With the summer focus and return from her true family, the king and the queen. She was reunited with Flynn too. Soon, a grand celebration was held, and they all lived happily ever after. Wow, that's amazing. Thank you, Daddy. You're welcome. Is that, the is, end. is that the whole book? Yes. You memorized the whole book? Yeah, I already know the whole thing. Oh, good. <laughs>